Hi friends, welcome back to my channel, SciTaker. In today's video, to, uh, to the speed test and the RAM management test comparison between the Realme Exxon Max versus Realme Exxon Pro smartphone. Let's see which phone will be able to open these games faster. And during this time, I'll try to use a high performance mode in both phones. And this is going to be really very interesting, friends. Let's see which phone can actually open these small games faster. That is what I'm going to exactly demonstrate in this video. And in case if you want me to do any other side by side comparisons, let me know in the comment section below. Definitely I'll try to do those kind of comparisons as soon as possible in both phones. So don't forget to follow the playlist as well, which will give the clear idea of what is going on between both devices. And it is the Exxon Pro which got booted up first in the Exxon Pro and then the Exxon Max is getting booted. And Dimensity 1000 Plus versus Dimensity 1200, 8GB Plus 8GB and 8GB Plus 5GB external RAM capabilities. I did turn on during the process of demonstration. So I'm trying to explain you each and every scenario what I'm trying to use and first phone to boot up is the Realme X1 Pro device, not bad. And uh, let me try to show you exactly the settings option. Just make sure that I did turn on the high performance mode. Let's go to the battery and uh, high performance mode is turned on. And even I did turn on the gain space mode as well. Yes, let me try to go to the performance mode and uh, high performance mode is turned on. As you can see, it's exactly in both phones. That's perfect. And these are the small 10 games which I did select in this process of demonstration. Let's see which phone can actually open these games faster. So let's get started with the first game, which is Subway of Game 1, 2, 3. So Dimensity 1200 and Dimensity 1000 plus chipset. So Realme X1 Max did to open this game faster than the Realme X1 Pro. And Candy Crush. Let's see the Candy Crush, what happened. Both phones are slightly close to each other, nothing much difference. And next is the uh, gateway tool. Let's see this game. So this game also is opening slightly faster. As you can see exactly, gain space is turned on, but it's not showing that uh, sometimes in the real mix and max when the when you're opening the games. In the real mix and pro, it's showing you how much free time is happening. But in the real mix and max, it's not showing sometimes. As you can see clearly what is happening. So next is a uh, smash it game and uh, let's see this game which phone not bad both phones did open at same time and crossy roads and let's see friends ram management how it will be there and right now you can see actually coming between both phones in the real max and max as well so in some scenarios it's not displaying how much ram is getting cleared so now it's displaying you can see before it did not show that so both phones are doing great and uh i'll climb racing as you can see friends, exactly kind of close to each other. Nothing much major difference is seen here using the small games. That's kind of good. And I need to use some big games as well. Maybe Madrigans Mobile, FIFA, Call of Duty, Asphalt 9. So using those games, I need to check how is the condition of the phone. So is kind of speed or not. So make sure to stay in for those videos in case if you're interested. So his Angry Birds has been started. And next is the uh, final game, which is Take Balls. Let's see what happens to with this game. Not bad. So both phones did great job in terms of the opening speeds and it is a complete all the 10 games which are completely open in the background as you can see friends. Clearly you can see. And now let me try to start opening the, all the games from the background from the back side. Let's see how many games will be there in both phones. So five games not an issue. Starting from the sixth game there will be an issue. Sixth game is the smash it game. Let's see what ends with the smash it game one two three. Realme X and Max did have in the background RAM management. As you can see, not bad. So in the RAM management, the Realme X and Max one point, it got scored. In the speed test also, the Realme X and Max were able to open some games faster. Some games kind of equal sometimes. Temple Run, both phones didn't show up. So overall, only one point for the Realme X and Max where it did keep the smash it game. And the X and Pro did keep only five games in the background. That's a you. Normal different, not, not a huge difference, I would say. So this is the kind of speed test comparison between both phones using the high performance mode and using the game space mode as well. And this is the results which we got right now. And next video, I'll try to upload using the high, heavy games, maybe close to uh, five games similarly like this, Asphalt 9, Barrygons, Mobile, Call of Duty, FIFA and Genshin Impact. I'll try to upload the video very soon. So make sure to stay tuned for those videos in case if you're interested. So again, I'll be back after next video, friends. Till then, stay tuned. Bye.